Hi, my name's Phil Jamison. Come see me in the role of St. Jimmy in Green Day's American Idiot. Tickets on sale now at ticketmaster.com.au. La, 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 la. <laughs> What can I tell you about my role in the musical American Idiot? I play St. Jimmy, who is a charming, devilish raconteur that lives in the city. Um, and he meets one of the main characters, Johnny, that's moved from Jingle Town, small town in USA, to the city. And he encourages Johnny, let's say down a more hedonistic path, and I revel in his choices. So the songs translate really well on a live theatre stage because they translate so well on a live rock stage. Like, um, they're great songs. You can't keep a good song down, right? That's basically, that's life. So I think that in this instant, um, Green Day wrote a rock opera in 04 with nine minute songs with many movements and many tempo changes and all this kind of creativity. And it wasn't until 09 that it became, you know, in, in, um, on a theatre stage. So I think that, I think it translates incredibly well. My favourite songs that I perform, well I like songs that I don't perform as well. I like What's the Name, I wish I was singing that. I like 21 Guns, wish I was singing that, not singing that. Um, look, I love Last Night on Earth, uh, a really pretty song from 21st Century Breakdown, and I'll, I love St. Jimmy, I love Know Your Enemy. But yeah, there's, there's lots of songs I really enjoy singing in this. This musical, it's kind of like a gateway musical. It's kind of like for for people that have come to, have gone to see Green Day Live, like myself. Green Day Live are, I think, incredibly theatrical anyway. Um, this is a new experience altogether, but it's still pretty rocking. Like, it's a, it's a really fun night. For theatre goers of a more traditional type, I think it's also a great lead into to other stuff as well. I mean, there's no such thing as a traditional musical anymore think that the, the, the parameters have changed so much, especially over the last decade, into what we think is a musical. So yeah, this is, um, this is great for everyone from five-year-olds to 80-year-olds. It's literally the worst nerves I've had in 22 years, I think. Namely because the cast that I'm working with are all freakishly good and never, ever make a mistake. And I'm really good at mistakes. I kind of built a career on it. So um, to have this kind of pressure of not making any is, um, yeah, it gets difficult. But look, yeah, I think nerves are good. And I think I'll approach the seasons that are coming up, Melbourne, Sydney, Adelaide, Perth, Brisbane, um, a little bit differently in the fact that I'm already in the role and I'm confident and I got recast. What a, there's no better way than a bit of confidence that someone go, hey, you're allowed to do it again. I guarantee you'll have a good time. There's no doubt about it. So yeah, it's definitely worth it. Hey, 